Bowers Game Corner presents Gen Con Video Bonanza 2016. Brought to you by Gutshot Games and their Gen Con release, Headhunters, a collectible card game and a collectible toy. And Shoot Again Games, makers of Looting Atlantis and Conspiracy. Look for Pinball Showdown on Kickstarter soon. Also brought to you by the generous support of these companies and our fantastic Kickstarter backers. Ahoy there, YouTube! I'm back again today for more of our Gen Con Bonanza Explosion blog coverage. We're live at Gen Con 2016 at the Archon Games booth, and we're going to be talking to Adam about their current Kickstarter right now, Eschaton. Yes. What is Eschaton? So Eschaton is a cult strategy deck building game in which you take the role of a cult leader at, in a dark fantasy world that is on the brink of Armageddon. So the notion of the game is that you want to create the best possible cult so that you can collect the finest relics, complete the omens of the Dark One, and control the realm map so you can earn his favor at the gates of oblivion. So how does it work? So down here uh, we have the Conclave and the Realm Map, so it's a deck builder, so you're going to be collecting cultists that are going to add to your deck that are going to influence the board in various ways. So some of the stats you can use is we have an Arcana deck that you'll be able to delve into to pull out fiends and powerful magic. You'll also be able to marshal armies in the field with the aggression stat, so that'll let you place cubes on the board to control territories. The territories themselves have victory points that uh, will aid you in your cause, as well as give you additional static stats that are going to complement your cards. Okay. And um, so what's the player count, time length, all that good sort of stuff? Sure. So it's a two to six player game. Uh, and the time length depends on the event deck. So the event deck is a semi-stacked random event countdown. So you'll have events and omens in there, and then somewhere in the back half of the deck is going to be the Armageddon card. So generally this game, if you're trying to play it quickly, you can do within 45 minutes to an hour. If you want to play an epically long game, you can go way longer, so up to like three or four. Uh, the game itself comes with 21 different event cards and 11 different omens, so it's not quite the same depending on how you want to play it. Uh, very, very cool. Uh, where can we steer people if they want to be more interested in the game or the company itself? Absolutely. Check out archongames.net. We have the Kickstarter online for the game, so you can go to tinyurl.com slash cultstarter. We'll get you there. All right. Very, very cool. Thank you very much, Adam. So that is Eschaton on Kickstarter probably right now, or it it's over and it succeeded, I'm going to guess. Uh, but if you're enjoying this Gen Con coverage, please be sure to click on the subscribe button below in the comments below. Let me know if you were in a cult, what would you name your cult? You're the leader. What's the name of the cult? Uh, uh, let's see. The Blood Zerkers. Blood Zerkers. I'd go with Ricky's Rockets. <laughs> Let me know in the comments below. As always, thanks for your time, YouTube. This was brought to you by Headhunters from Gunshot Games, Pinball Showdown from Shoot Again Games, these great companies, and fans like you.